markers are a great way to add a decorative as well as a functional item to your Word 2007 document. Um, you can have a border around a whole page, around a paragraph, uh, selected text, uh, table cells. You can have them just about around any part of your Word document. If you want to do a um, page border that surrounds the whole page, then you don't need to select anything. If you do just want it about a, around a paragraph, then you can go ahead and select that paragraph. Same thing, if it's a few words, go ahead and select that before you go to the page borders option. I'm going to apply it to the whole page, so I'm going to go ahead and just put my cursor anywhere in my document. Click on the page layout tab, and in the page background section, click on page borders. And we're going to get the borders and shading dialog box. It's going to automatically come up to the page border section and there's also a borders tab and as you can see it's pretty much the exact same thing except for down to where it says apply to. You apply this to a paragraph, to a few words, and the page border you're going to apply to the whole thing. You can also in here choose to apply it to different sections. So we're going to stay in the page border section but the border section is really similar. You have a couple settings over to the left. You can choose none if you want no page border. You can choose a box which puts a box around the whole page. A shadow, 3D, and then a custom one. And with any of these you can change where you have borders at so you can only put them on the sides, you can only put them on the top or bottom, all sorts of combinations, whatever you want. I think we'll stick with just a box. Down in the style, you can scroll down and click a style that you like. Choose a double line. And color, you can choose a color that you like. Okay, art. These are really decorative down here, borders that you can add. So you just click on the one that you'd like to apply if you'd like one of those. We're going to apply it to the whole document. And we're going to click OK. And as you can see, we have this nice, very professional border going around uh, our entire page.